Okay, I'm back with another video, and this is where we left off. Now, the sand part is boring, so I'm just going to skip all of that and go directly to the end. So, there's a few building trap tips I'm going to give you along the way, so get your building notebooks out. Note one When using tripwire hooks, You can actually, I have to show you so you can see it because I don't think I can explain it that well. But you can put banners on string through a trip wire hook. So it'll look, I think it's a, so it'll look normal to someone, but to you. See the banners? You can do it to dispensers. Oh, see that banner? There's actually a trip wire. Ow. Okay. Boom. 120. And then you see, if you go back and check the video, that, that was not open before. And sorry for the piston noises. It's just some redstone broke. So, anyways, now that you saw that, I'm going to show you how it works. So it, it would be better to go in mode. Just go delete this. So, in this, I will show you the command, and for the shovel, and I will also show you the, how all the traps work. For this, it's pretty easy to know what it is. There's magma under carpet. Oh, and by the way, this is all in pocket edition. And these just mirror the image of there being stone. This. You have to go underground to see. Piston versus again. Well, I'm just going to break the piston. Okay. So this one I'll go in and do one to show. There is cobwebs here, and there are signs here, and there is a trap chest on a block, which will, if I press it, trigger the piston to push the signs which will destroy them that might sound complicated but it's actually a pretty easy trap now you will this is pretty easy just press the pressure plates and dispensers to dispense out lava now this this is a little more hard. You have to connect every pressure plate up to the dispensers that shoot arrows. This is just a boss fight. You can use dispensers to put armor on them. This, just hook the tripwire hook up to this. This, now this is tricky. Just basically you have three pistons lined up. I will show you how to make that in our video because it will bomb me. You might want to know. Now this can break. So what you're going to do, you have to be in creative mode. 
she has to be on your world. Now you're going to go to chat and put that slash. Now you're going to give, say, give at S, which is yourself, or if you want to give everyone it, it's at A. Let's say you can say whatever you want. Wooden, I'm saying pick X. Pick X. Now, you have to put one since you want one, and then just put zero. I will give you time to copy this command at the end. Then you're going to do this. You're going to say Minecraft Ken underscore great great can break. say the blocks which is bed rock but this won't actually break bedrock that could be any block it's just allowing you to be able to mine it so it won't actually allow you to break bedrock and it only allows you to mine it in adventure mode now you would take this and boom Oh. Sorry, I forgot to give you time to copy it. It's Ken Destroy. So, yeah, this is the command. Pause the video and go wait ten, about five seconds. Okay, so now I will send the command and you get a pickaxe that says can break bedrock. Remember, this is all in pocket edition. It'll say you can break bedrock, but you actually can't unless you're in creative. Now that's everything. I think for the rest of the video, I'm just going to show you how to make that redstone contraption. This is very nice to make it. I would recommend it in a secret base. But you do need slime and tiny blocks for this to work. I think I'm going to end the video, start a new one, and we're going to come back to building with redstone. So, bye!